All right, yo, what's up, you guys? Melvin here, aka Sweaty Gaming Games. Thank you for sharing another video here on the channel. Um, so today we, I am. Hold on. Yo, guys, so. I'm Ryan, filmmaker. All right, let's go back. All right, yo, what's up, you guys? Melvin here, aka Sweaty Gaming Games. Thank you for checking out another video here on the channel. Um, so today's video, I am gonna show you guys finally. Um, I got this Inspire Cable Functional Trainer over at Costco. So it's actually a gift for me last year, and I actually have a video of me putting it together. I'll put it on the description below. So if you guys are ever gonna purchase this one and. Um, hopefully you guys watch that video and see if it helps you guys build it. Um, so I finally, I've been wanting to make a video of the exercises that I do in here. So for the most part, it got me through the pandemic. Um, I couldn't go to the gym and stuff like that. So this is the exercises. The exercise that I do is mostly here and then it kind of keep me in maintenance phase. So, um, didn't try, I didn't lose or gain weight or anything like that. Kept me strong a little bit until I'm ready to go back to the gym. I still do this mostly for like arms and stuff like that. So I'm going to show you guys some of the exercises that i do so if you guys like this kind of video click that like button and then subscribe too to see some of the other exercises that i'm going to share using this cable system yeah so um all right so for today guys you guys can see on the right side right here today i'm going to show you guys a few exercises that i use on bicep and triceps um so your biceps and your triceps right here so it's going to be an arm workout so i'm just going to show you guys a few simple exercises that we can do on the cable um, on the cable system right over here um so first up we are going to go into cable curls so what you guys going to do is the the machine actually comes with two d-bar handles so you're just going to attach this on each side Put it at the lower setting and then what you guys are working on are the biceps so what we're going to do is we're going to start in this position grab the d-bar handles and then curl your arms just bend it on the elbows shoulders um, close to your body as possible elbows close to your body as possible and then you're just gonna curl okay very simple you guys i like to keep my exercise simple so we don't have to be super fancy to make some gains you know maybe eventually when you get so advanced and you probably do some dynamic stuff where you combine exercises but for the most part you guys don't really need to be like super complicated yeah so um so that's what we're gonna do um we're gonna do as much as we can um i but the way i um, test my intensity is something called rest and reserves so I pick a weight if I can do it for like over 10 and then I feel like I can do like another 10 or another you know five or something then I'll bump up the weight to the point that like on my last reps I feel like I can only do like one or two so that's kind of like almost failure you don't want to always go to failure so all right let's go guys So this is our starting position for your legs you guys pick your base of support you guys can go wide you guys can go narrow or you can you can step forward so just something to keep you guys stable so you're gonna keep there you go keep your arms close to your body as possible because I can do 10 of them and I feel like I could only probably like two through two or three um, so we stick to that we stick to that one and then do maybe two to three sets of those and then yeah and then as you guys move on of course you know we will go up and then you guys might want to do a few more extra sets all right so that's for the cable course next one we're gonna do another bicep exercises but this time you guys are gonna use the ropes and you guys are gonna grip it like a hammer So this time we are going to use the ropes that came with it. The neat thing about this one is sometimes I don't plan to bring this to the gym. I just don't want to lose it because sometimes the ropes that they have at the gym is kind of filthy. And it's it's like wear and tear and all that stuff. So I plan on bringing this. I just don't want to lose it. But anyways, you are going to put this all the way at the bottom. You're going to grip it like a hammer. You're going to start off at the bottom. 
And again, you're gonna keep your shoulders straight, close to your body as possible, and you're just gonna bend on the elbows right over here okay the difference about this one is our first exercise is you guys are doing an under underhand grip so from here so it's working a different part of the bicep head but then when you do a hammer curls it's working a different part of the bicep head and then it's actually going to work a different part of the bicep if you do this one too there's more exercises that you can do in this arm but for this video we're only going to do hammers so Again, we are gonna pick an exercise um, weight, exercise load, where we can go maybe a couple more, couple more sets until failure. So we we want to test out the weight that is good for you. That weight was pretty light for me because I feel like I could probably do like 25 or 30 more. So of course on the next, on knowing that after the next set, I will actually increase the weight and stuff. But then that's kind of how I determine my intensity. You guys don't have to do it that way, but usually you want to go up to failure if you guys want to challenge your muscle in order for it to grow. Um, all right, so, but that's up to you. Play around with the weights and stuff like that. Just keep it safe, keep it slow. Make sure you're doing the form right. So that's the first thing you guys wanna focus. All right, so those are a couple of cable exercises that you can do for your biceps. And the next one, we are gonna do triflex extension. This time we're still gonna use the ropes as well. So your triceps are your masses, muscles right here in the back of your arm. So for this one, what we're gonna do is we're gonna use the cable. We're gonna use the rope again. We are gonna use the rope again, but this time it's gonna come from the top. Again, try to keep your arms close to your body as possible. Maybe sleeping down a little bit, whatever is comfortable. Find your base of support for your legs, and then you're gonna just pull down. Squeeze, squeeze when you go down, you'll feel the triceps, and then go back up. Okay, all right, again, go for a weight that you can do um, how many reps as possible before failure? Maybe one or two reps before failure. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four. We're squeezing at the bottom. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, So that one I can do more for sure, but I kind of wanted to show you guys the exercises, the technique and all the stuff. Of course, um, you figure out the positioning as you go and you get more advanced. You'll find out the positioning of your legs, where your angle is, and um, pretty much the beginning. If you guys are beginners, some, some for the most part, you guys are focusing on technique and also trying to get that mind-body connection so that you guys can feel the muscle that you guys are actually trying to work. Maybe for the first time, you might you know, feel in your shoulders, feel in your stomach, feel in your back or something like that. So you're trying to adjust. Um, that's why you want to try to get some help, you know, if you can, um, just to um, help you with technique and stuff like that. So, but pretty much that is your tricep extensions, working on that one. The next one we're gonna do, we're gonna do overhead tricep extensions. Um, so pretty much this one, you're gonna, we're gonna use the rope again. We are gonna lunge forward. For me, I lunge forward. And then we're gonna hold it like this, and then we are gonna pull, okay? Again, we're keeping the arms straight, and then the movement is gonna be on the elbows. Your triceps job is to extend your elbows, so you don't want to be moving your shoulders too much. Most of the most of the movements will be on the elbow extension, relax, and then extension. Okay, all right. For this one, um, I don't know if it's just for me. I kind of like to lunge and have half of my butt on on one of the poles of the of the machine so that I'm a little bit more stable so I'm not getting pulled forward or back when I'm lifting pretty heavy on the ropes. All right, here we go guys. See, you guys see my right butt right now is pushing against the bar and I'm gonna do a little lunge. I'm gonna lean forward, 
I feel a stretch on your triceps and then you pull. One, squeeze. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So those are a few exercises you guys can start off with if you guys want to work on your arms using, I mean, it doesn't have to be Inspire. This is the one that I, we got and this is the one that was offered in Costco. So it was pretty cool. I mean, I'm, we're happy with the purchase. Um, so those are any cable systems you guys usually it will come with those accessories, the ropes and the D handles. Just a lot more. So I'll make more videos that one. So if you guys like, so click the subscribe button. Also, um, I'll post a lot of social stuff at the bottom. So you guys want to follow me on like Instagram. That's where usually I post some of my gym exercises that I do because I do work out here at home and I do work out at the gym as well because there is some stuff that I cannot do with the cables. So I'd like doing at the gym. So you guys follow the Instagram page. Um, also, um, I stream my workouts on on Instagram, on, on Twitch and YouTube. And I'm actually gonna move over to Theta TV. I'm gonna start streaming there since I'm getting a little bit onto crypto. So if you guys are into that one, go check out Theta TV and find me there, Sweaty Gamer Gains. Um, I'm there and give me a follow there too. So, all right guys, so click the like button if you guys like this video and subscribe to get more videos. And until next time guys, hopefully you guys like it. I hope you guys learned something and catch you guys later. Peace guys, stay safe.